Uh, to extend um, a welcome to you all, please welcome the National Chairman of the Prostate Cancer Foundation, Graeme Johnson. Thank you, um, ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of my fellow directors, uh, I'd like to thank you all for being here this afternoon. And a special thanks to you, Anthony, for hosting this in this fantastic building and fantastic space. And I'm glad you gave us a little history of the room. I've been fortunate in the position of chairman of uh, being in two of the most magnificent spaces in Sydney in the last two months, having been at Government House at the end of March and being here today. So um, with that, I do put up with the flying. <laughs> the, the new DVD we're launching today is a vital new resource for men with prostate cancer, but importantly as well for their partners and their families. The DVD has already been distributed to 90 PCFA support groups across Australia, to the CEO of each Cancer Council in Australia, to the Federal Health Minister, the Honourable Nicola Roxon and State Health Ministers, and to our great friend and supporter and prostate cancer survivor, the Federal Treasurer Wayne Swan, which might result in a little bit of quid pro quo, we hope. <laughs> um, and we've distributed it to the media. Uh, the DVD will be sent to the medical profession, and I'm pleased to announce today that we'll also be sending a copy of this DVD to every Rotary Club in Australia, as well as details on how individual Rotarians may purchase additional copies. I want to speak a little bit about Rotary today because PCFA is very proud of its links with Rotary and it's very fitting that you, Anthony, are our host today uh, as the member for Lane Cove uh, because that's where it all began for us 12 years ago, as you've already mentioned. We've experienced enormous growth over the last few years, but we will always remember that we had our genesis at Lane Cove Rotary. Rotary, as you know, is a wonderful community-based organisation in Australia. And in terms specifically of prostate cancer, not only did they help establish PCFA, but over the past 10 years, hundreds of Rotary groups across the country have combined to donate more than $750,000 to fund some of our vital programs. And it goes without saying that we are hoping that our strong relationship with Rotary will continue to grow. At the last meeting of the PCFA National Board, it was agreed to anoint or appoint uh, Dr Rene Taylor from Peter McCallum Institute as the PCFA inaugural Rotary Fellow. And we're funding some research that she is doing. Future issues of Prostate News and Rotary Down Under will feature updates on her vital research. So that publicly demonstrates the link and um, support we get from Rotary. In conclusion, and in thanking you again, Anthony, um, it gives me great pleasure to present to you a magnificent Henry Buck's silk PCFA tie <laughs> and wear it proudly as the member for Lane Co, but more importantly as a long-term friend of PCFA. Thank you very much.